Hey guys, Ty Boy here with another unboxing and today we are unboxing the Victrix Pro BFG controller. This controller has been out for a while. It's specifically for Xbox. Um, it's Victrix by PDP now, by the way. So there's like a weird tree. Turtle Beach owns Victrix and Victrix is by PDP now. Um, so it's a little bit of a tree there, but we don't care about that. We care about the controller that we are unboxing. So this controller is mainly used for those who competitively game, whether it's first person shooters or even fighting games because there's a weird fighting game stick attachment to this which you'll see in a second so let's take a look at the side actually let's take a look at this side so six button fight pad module um, USB-C cable typical and, and uh, replacement sticks and uh, d-pads and all things like that carrying case uh, a module swap tool which we'll get into that a little bit later and a reversible d-pad which I think you can see it right over here pretty cool and obviously the controller itself so um, take a look at the back it shows you everything these are the modules that you'll be able to interplace and switch around so if you want to be like a ps5 controller you can do that or if you want to keep regular um, Xbox analog sticks or if you want to change the buttons too, you could do that as you see here it's like the fight stick button let's open it up enough of me talking hopefully we get this open All right, so right away we have the carrying case, which every pro controller that you get these days have a nice carrying case. It's like a it's like a thing now. Um, it all started with like the Xbox Elite controller. The Turtle Beach unboxing that we did a couple months ago also had one. I guess they think you're going to take this to esports tournaments and things like that, which I'm not. Um, it's going to be sitting around in my house doing nothing and holding. Uh, probably parts for the controller in case I need to. Anyways, let's open it up. Boop. Nice zipper there. All right, now it's the holy grail. Take a look at that. Before I take it out, it looks pretty clean. Um, typical Xbox middle, middle button there. Uh, the analog sticks, pretty smooth. All right, let's take it out. Enough of me uh, <laughs> all about the looks there. All right, so. Yeah, I mean, overall, nice controller, nice purple uh, outlines there. Victrix, always purple at Rectify. We love purple. In the back, you have the paddles. You have these things here. The D-pads here, a little bit different, little little square. Um, and the triggers there, pretty cool. Overall, pretty nice controller. Um, the other contents within the box include the USB-C cable, which is all purple, which is long enough if you're gonna plug this in to use for PC. If you don't want to charge it, you can just leave it plugged in. I mean, when I play on PC, I don't care about the Bluetooth capabilities too much, but it's nice to have over here. So you have the buttons here, the replacement mo uh, module that you have with these here. So I could put it like over here, which I'll have a video on how to um, install these a little bit later on for everyone. So, because it can be a little bit confusing when, you, when it comes to controllers. Oh, piece of plastic on there. Anyways, pretty cool. The fight pad in case you want to play a fighting game instead of buying like the Victrix. Uh, they have a fighting pad now, which is actually really cool. And lastly, this is the pick tool that you will need to um, take out the modules that are on the controller, which there's like uh, little screws here and there. Victrix does have a new Hall Effect module that you can uh, install onto these controllers. It's an official one. I know there's a lot of off-brand ones, but it's actually pretty cool. They sent this over for review. So it does come in like a little box. It did slightly open it just to take a look. So. Hall effect. So yeah, then they have replacement ones to make it last longer. And then I'll be, stay tuned for another video on our channel. I probably have it linked below here um, and how to install these on the controller, which is very important. Um, it's nice to have some replacement parts. These are like $30 on, online on Amazon or uh, Victrix Pro site. But overall, I think the Victrix Pro controller looks really nice. I think it feels nice. Now, how does it perform? Stay tuned for our review. Make sure to hit that subscribe button. Make sure to like and comment, and I'll see you guys next time.